shorts. We've been playing this for over an hour, and all you've done is drank. That's not true. We went to, and th we did uh, the tour of the Guinness storehouse. Oh, Guinness, you're so good to me. And we went to the kiss place with the rock. Blarney Castle? That's the place. Okay, well, now the three of you are in the middle of Temple Bar, Dublin. Before any- Top of the morning to you, laddies. It's 4 p.m. Everyone make a perception check. Eighty-one. L. Well, this went arseways fast. As you stumble along the crowded street, Waylon, a small man with a red beard, bumps into you and almost spills your beer. Hey, what the? Oh. Hey, man. You a leprechaun? The man looks furious. I'm not a leprechaun. I'm shart. <laughs> what? You, you did what? I said I'm shart. Wait. <laughs> short stars and horseshoes, clovers and blue moons. He's short. He's not a leprechaun. He hands all of you a card, each with a different inscription. I can't see this, what this says at all, please. A magic sprite of mine, ye must travel to the college three. Inside you'll find a special book. Inside its spine, ye take a look. Sarah, maybe move the card a little further away from your face. A four-leaf clover you will find. A pot of gold will then be thine. <laughs> what is this? Well, normal context clues would tell you that it's a semi-cryptic message left to you by a leprechaun. Leprechaun? You mean that short guy that pooped his pants? You head to Trinity College. You're looking for the Book of Kells. Roll investigation checks. 60. Six. Double L. You found the book. Great job. You open it up, and inside you find a four-leaf clover. It's glowing. Glowing how? Like, like glowing or like glow? Like, like glowing like we could eat it? Should we eat it? Hold on. If that guy was a leopard con, why couldn't he just find this thing? What? Do we get gold? Leprechauns can just find stuff with magic. Magic. Well, that's a surprisingly cogent point coming from someone who just rolled a 60 for their investigation check. Thank you. Are we eating the thing? Before any of you can react, a strong gust of wind jets through the library. Book pages are torn from their jackets and thrown about the long, ornate room. What's going on here? Is it that guy with the shirts? Within moments, you find yourself separated from one another by a complex series of opaque, iridescent walls. Looks like you're in a labyrinth. Hey! What's the crack with this rainbow maze, huh? Do we have to answer a riddle or something? Lance, what's your AC? Uh... 14. As you question the ether, you feel a sharp pain in your left ankle as the mysterious stranger from before appears at your feet and bites you. Take eight damage. Um, ow. Hold on a second. I think I know about a spell I heard about a time for this, maybe. Sarah, what's your AC? Chaotic neutral. Great. Well, the man appears in front of you and slaps you in the face. Take five damage. Blarney Castle! That's the place with the rock we licked. I knew it this whole time. Waylon, what's your AC? I'm gonna cast with or without you. Wait, what? Once per day, as a bonus action, you can summon the undeniable star power of international superstar, Paul David Hewson. Paul David H Hoosen? Wait, is that Bono? Yeah, it's Bono. Of course it is. What's it do? Apparently, uh, whatever we want. So I think I'd like him to kill his bad guy and goes back to the bar. Let me see that, please. How's that for lucky? Okay, okay, guys, I know I said that I was gonna eat the thing in the book, but maybe we should just go get some of that shepherd's pie, right? <laughs> Just give me whiskey and a potato, and I'm good to go. Okay, well, this is insane, but apparently a spiritual visage of Bono appears above you. 
deadly. The walls disappear, the leprechaun disappears, the wind stops, and you're all just fine, I guess. <laughs> Dude, Irish edition is fun. Well, it wouldn't have been if it weren't for Bono. Stupid Bono. Where do you guys want to go next? No, 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 no. You guys picked Canada, Australia, and Ireland. The next time we go abroad, I get to pick. And I have a pretty good feeling I already know where we'll be going. D&D swag, 20D20s in my dice bag. Hello, everyone. I hope you enjoyed that episode. Remember, we're back to a weekly schedule, so come back next Sunday for the next one. Just a quick notice, channel memberships will be coming soon. Memberships will give you access to a bunch of cool perks like behind-the-scenes footage and discounts on merchandise, which is another thing that's coming soon. New merchandise. Merchandise. The official announcement for those things will come later this week, so keep your eyes open here and on social media. Also, I'm on a podcast. It's called the No Big Banana Podcast. My friends Justin and Co. Cody and I just talk about whatever. It's available wherever you listen to stuff. And more new content in general is going to be coming to the channel this year. Stay safe out there and take care of each other.